The Super Hawks are getting some love from the glove. Gary Payton, Detlef Shrem, Coach Lenny Wilkins. The TBL, as you mentioned, is newer. It's in its fifth season, 44 teams across the country. The Super Hawks, as a pro team, they make it an ideal spot for G League and NBA hopefuls to land. Dreaming to do this. Hanging on to the dream to play professional basketball, 25-year-old Justin Moore and 28-year-old Treshawn Fletcher are ready to suit up for Seattle's newest pro team, the Superhawks, a part of the Basketball League or TBL. Born and raised in Tacoma, Fletcher came up a Sonics fan. Now he'll be part of a pro basketball rebirth in Seattle. Fletcher and Moore are older than your typical NBA recruit, but that's not stopping them from shooting for their dreams even after finishing up playing for Toledo and Georgia Tech, respectively. Only the top guys had Baller's Life and all those mixtapes. Not everybody got it, you know, so but I've just been just taking a long road and just waiting my turn. Playing in this league, playing this year is going to help benefit us to get to the next level with all the film we're going to be able to get and stuff like that. So we just have to do our part now. Doing their part to bring men's pro basketball back to their hometown of Seattle, husband and wife duo Pierre Crockwell and Jacqueline Yang. Yang's making history as the first woman of Asian descent to own a professional men's team in North America. We wanted to provide a platform for these athletes to showcase their talents and um, to be able to develop both professionally on the court and off the court um, and, and get involved with the community. And the organization wants Superhawks games to be an option for everyone. This is an opportunity to really reach out in the communities and get people in, families and, and, and youth that maybe can't afford to go to a professional sports game and can come out and enjoy some basketball and, and uh, really create a strong fan base. Plus, the team launch could be crucial to the city's NBA hopes. Former Supersonics already showing their support for the Super Hawks. I'm a big fan of basketball. My children played basketball. I played basketball. Um, to help bring the Sonics back to Seattle, this is a part of it. This is a part of helping bring the Sonics back. Now it's time to build the team. Enter former basketball agent J.R. Harris as GM and Super Hawks head coach, UW Hall of Famer and former NBA player Eldridge Reckhasner. We feel in our region, in the team that we built, uh, we think we can identify talent and probably bring a championship our first year. So many talented young men here in the city of Seattle, so a lot of them don't have an opportunity to, to make the NBA, but this is going to give them an opportunity to maybe play in Asia or over in Europe. Playing professional hoops and making money while doing it is what these guys are aiming to do. Out of college, raising families, but still balling. I tell everybody I just need an opportunity. I'll take advantage of the rest. Well, when the season gets going, the Superhawks will play their home games here at Seattle Pacific University. Uh, there's two tryouts coming up, and that's going to be at another location. The first session is this Sunday. Uh, there's going to be about 15 guys on the roster, 10 of them on paid contracts. And the ideal player is someone who's done playing in college but wants to play professionally and is good enough to do that. Uh, if you're interested in registering for those tryouts or you know somebody who should be trying out or you want to get your hands on some new Superhawks gear, just text the word SUPER to 206-448-4545. Live in Seattle, Farah Jadrin, King 5 News. I love the logo, like the shirts mm -hmm. and the idea. I mean, yeah. Seattle is a basketball town without an NBA team, so. Absolutely. Fun to see this. Farah, thanks. Thank you, Farah.